right, so now we head to the States uh, for both IndyCar and the Xfinity Series. Cup Series actually got postponed. So that's going to be taking place after the recording session. So yeah. that's why we're not talking about Cup, but we might cover it on YouTube, see how we go. Uh, but IndyCar, though, um, started off with Scotty McLaughlin getting My pole boy. position. My boy. How good. Uh, did you see how he put a sticker on the car? Not very well. Not very well, no. But <laughs> in saying that, though, he did get the early lead. Uh, and he was in uh, contention for the win. It was actually a, which Penske was going to win, basically. That, that's it that was Mitchell a Penske race. dominated. Um, they do dominate that track pretty well. Mm. And I mean, it was a sixth time, unfortunately for me, that Joseph Newgarden, I think it was sixth time, fifth time, something like that. Yeah, he's like the um, king of um, St. Saint, Saint Louis. Yeah. Pretty much. <laughs> Joseph Newgarden. <laughs> but uh, it was either Penske or uh, Malukas um, yes. that was going to win this weekend. Unfortunately, though, for him, uh, he had a little tap with um, Will Power, uh, and he went straight into the fence, and then Karma sort of bit Power later on. I think Will Power, I don't know how he's <laughs> never seen a psychologist. Oh, like, He's just so angry all the time. <laughs> I think it's the Aussie in him. <laughs> it's a bit too much, man. But, but um, yeah, it is what it is, I guess. But um, yeah. he led a lot. Mm. He led 117 laps. And to just crash out because the thing is it was such a weird crash uh or it weird was. incident it was uh, as the restart was going to take place so it was, it was, it was, by the way <laughs> this is in the back end of the race Ten you haven't missed go. anything nothing has happened between the first lap one in 170 but basically <laughs> um <laughs> sorry no it was 260 lap race it was a 260 lap and race nothing happened for the first 240 you can forget about the <laughs> 170 laps <laughs> Yeah, um, yeah, so what happened with Willpower is they were about to restart. Uh, all the Penske guys were up there. Uh, Rossi was behind. He, actually, Colton Herder actually was in front of Willpower, I believe, from memory. Yeah, Rossi was behind um, Willpower. That's right. And uh, unfortunately, I don't. it's strange. It looks like Power accidentally went on the Power uh, and then didn't yeah, want it. Yeah, it was to. a checkup situation. He, of, he sped up and then didn't, but Rossi thought he sped up. So he, it was one of those yeah. Lance Stroll, Daniel Ricciardo Fortunately, ones. these cars don't have brake lights, so... No, you don't know when someone's breaking in front of you. Mm. Besides the actual car coming too close to your face, yeah. Um, and yeah, Will Will Power was like, "Do I go? Don't I go?" He did go, then he didn't go, and then Alex. Rossi Unfortunately just for Rossi, yeah, flew over him. He went real high up too. And that's his yeah. first race back. He saw the moon since because um, he missed out the last round in Toronto. I think that was the last round. Yeah, it was. Um, did they have the incident? Theo actually replaced him. Yeah. Because he had a broken oh, that's right. thumb or something like that. Or yeah, the thumb. McLaren. Uh, they swap their drivers like musical chairs. The HR department <laughs> must have a field day, don't they? Well, they probably don't even keep their places either. They probably <laughs> swap HRs every week. So there you go. But uh, un how way. unfortunate! It's a it's a sexy looking car though. I really like. I really love the, the white, white and orange. orange. Yeah. Unfortunately, though, it looks we saw all of again. it. Yeah, we, we saw the whole we thing. Didn't see all of even it. the under under underneath. That was, yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. Interesting, but. Uh, <laughs> Yeah, that was a freak weird incident, wasn't it? Uh, it was weird. That. But um, unfortunately for Power, that knocked him out. So it was down to New Guard. And even, it, like I said. Well, he the, made sure New Guard knew about it. Exactly. And New Guard actually got really lucky too. He had a, he had, this was a bit, I think, earlier on. Yeah. A he had a. I think actually he caused the spin. The caution. Oh, hang on. No, no, caused no, no, no. the caution. Yeah, sorry. He had a Correct spin. us if we're wrong. We're just trying to remember from memory. But uh yeah, he he had a lucky save. He could he have. Um, it was fighting. He could Scott. have crashed down himself. He was fighting Scott's mm. lead and overtook some back, back markers. Mark, yeah, Scott somehow didn't end up in the wall. Mm. Um, overtaking the outside where all the marbles are. You know, two hundred and fifty laps in. Yeah, there's a lot of uh, what they call marbles on the outside line, and um, yeah, Joseph got him and mm. somehow didn't hit the wall. He just that had was a half a good spin. Save. It was lucky. It was a good um, save. So the fact that he fall. won the race as well. Sensational, it's ridiculous. Will Power, though, unfortunate for him. But uh, and he that Penske. was actually. Are you able to quickly just go to the championship standings while I quickly sure? Because uh, obviously it was Pelo versus Power. Um, so Will Power has dropped because he had a rough weekend. I think, I think from memory from Toronto. Will yeah, Power, yeah, yeah. So at well, the he moment got, he he's dropped down McLaughlin. to fourth position now, um, right ahead of Scotty Mack. Like you said, seven points uh, is between the two Penske cars. I don't even know where Joseph Newgarn is, but Alex Pelot still leads the championship um, ahead of Colton Herder now. 
Um, so it's going to be very interesting uh, as we head into the final, st- the second half of the season. But let's run through the top 10. Um, Joseph Newgarden obviously got the win for that one, the king of St. Louis. Uh, then Scotty Mack, P2, what could have been for him? Um, by the way, I forgot to mention that pit stop that Joseph Newgarden had, that's pretty much how he won the race. Yeah. 5.1 second pit stop in an IndyCo is no easy feat. Well, because um, they didn't have to put any fuel in. No. Not like a, do- a drop. No, it was just, it was beep, just beep, like boom, boom. Exactly. Yeah. Uh, and that was basically the crucial point um, of the race there, <laughs> yep. getting getting ahead of Scotty Mack's team there. Uh, and then Lund- Lundquist in uh, third position there. He's a rookie too. He did. Pre- he actually did pretty well this race, actually. Yeah. Uh, and then Alex Plo, championship leader in fourth, ahead of um, championship contender Colton Herder. Uh, and then in sixth pos- position, Rosenquist, another quist. Uh, and then uh, Siegel, the rookie, the McLaren rookie, after winning Le Mans, as we keep saying, P7. Armstrong in eighth. That's uh, Marcus Armstrong, uh, the XF2 driver. And then your boy, Alex, with the gr- world's greatest name. Yeah, that's all I know about him. Stingray Rob. Stingray Rob. He just loves the name. That dude. Uh, and then in 10th place is uh, VK, and Scotty Dixon is in 11th there. But uh, Col- um, Pato Award, unfortunately, had an engine failure, I believe, from memory. Yep. So, uh, unfortunate for him. But uh... 